Hello everyone. Welcome to our uh, today's um, activities which is uh, entitled DNA extraction. Okay. So to to begin with, so you know and you have learned that DNA uh, codes for our inheritance and for today we are about to see how this DNA looks like a simple observation and simple DNA extraction only of using a fruit okay so to start with we have our uh, specimen right here which is um, the fresh uh, fruit sample I opted to use the strawberry we have uh, 50 ml of water right there salt table salt we also we are going to to use um, the dishwashing liquid which is equivalent into 5 ml of it okay we have to take tissue paper I'm going to put this one first we're going to use this one to um, remove or to to get the uh, DNA um, sample later on and of course you should have uh, the Ziploc bag, uh, bag or uh, a Ziploc um, container so that you can pound um, and also mix the materials that you're going to use in the experimentation okay and don't forget students that your sanitizer or an alcohol which is at least 70 percent it must be um, chilled right and finally we have the um, cup for our observation all right so I'm going to uh, to pause for a while so I can uh, begin see you right to, to begin with uh, let us set aside first uh, the toothpick, the tissue. Okay, let's put this one on the side. And we are going to um, add uh, the following. So you have the, uh, you mix the 5 ml of dishwashing liquid with water. Okay. And then um, add at least a teaspoon of salt okay can you see the salt right here so uh the the salt crystals right there yeah okay so use that one ladle and you put the one in your solution okay. and of course yeah, all you have to do is to mix them properly. Okay. Yes. That one. All right. So go on. I just um. Uh, what is this? Just mix and mix. Okay. Up to uh, it creates uh, a solution. There. Try to, to look at it. Okay, so I created already a mixture, not that so much uh, uh, cream, it's just fine. Okay, all right, so after that. After that, you have to to get your um, Ziploc um, paper, uh, paper bag, and you have to place first at least the uh, the four. <laughs> Look at that in there, okay? And then after that, you have to uh, place. You have to place your solution inside here. Okay. So. Just 
just to give you some information, uh, the salt in here will destroy the cell wall of um, the strawberry, okay? And um, the a dishwashing liquid, it contains enzyme too, okay? So that the DNA later on will be easily um, uh, be coiled, okay? So, uh, let's remove some And we have to, to pound okay let's pound this okay the strawberry okay can, can you see that the strawberry is a little bit hard you know <laughs> okay so that would be you can see the the strawberries okay they are not yet properly mix so I'm going to mix all of them. Okay, but let me remove first some sort of right. And they they must be mixed properly together. again or crush uh, this uh, strawberry so more and more um, nucleus will be exposed and we can get more and more um, a DNA right there Students, this is not a uh, waste of everything, waste of time and waste of money. Don't, uh, don't uh, think about that one, okay? Because um, this is for your own good. You can at least you can see uh, what we are actually talking about in our. Um, this is what it looks like. continue to, to pound and make sure they are properly properly um, mixed right there Can you see it? I know there's still some um, pieces of, or I mean, uh, the fruit is still intact. So you have to, to press them on. Okay. Press, press, press. Press. All right. So after that, you have this kind of a solution Uh, let me take photo first from 
here. Okay, so after that, uh, students, after we are done, okay, so all you have to do is to zip them or to, uh, to use this kind of strainer in there, okay, and put this one in a, this, a container like this, okay, and put this one at the top so that we can sift through or we can um, let's try to do it Ooh. okay a little bit hairy okay right there Ooh. let's just wait for for it to, to settle down I'm going to uh, while uh, we're waiting you can see I have collected already the solution it's in here okay. let me just uh, sift through more of it okay I'll just uh, place this one first in here okay you're right there and let me take the chilled um, ethanol okay for a while right I'm back Okay, so I think this is completely, completely um, um, sift through. Let me use this one first. Okay, and this one will be. Alright. Now, uh, the moment of truth. <laughs> okay, please wait. Uh, let me. There are some from from here. This is already uh, it passed through the the sifter. Okay, I just wanted to, to collect some portions of it. Yeah, right there. I think that would be enough. And what you have to do next is to. Use this one. I uh, I returned this one a while ago in um, in the uh, refrigerator so that it will be really really um, it will be really really uh, like so cold. <laughs> All right. So can you see the sample right there? Okay, that's the sample. And this is the moment of truth right now. I wanted to, to put right there. Ooh, what was that? Oh no, students. Oh, where is my... Oh God, take a look, take a look. Can you see there are two? Not miss this one and you should uh, look at it and try it by yourself look this is the dna structure or this is the dna guys okay oh my goodness 
that's the DNA. This white part right here, that is the DNA. Okay? How I wish we have a microscope right here so that we can see, we can see this uh, DNA right there. So I, I think that that would be all for uh, for my recording. Um, students, all right. So this is a successful a uh, work from home and an experiment from home activity. So I hope you guys can also look and see and check that uh, this is very possible. Uh, that even though we are working at home, learning will take place. Right. Once again. Look at the DNA from the YouTube videos that we are watching um, previously. It's in there. That's how the DNA structure is actually um, looking at or looking look like. It looks like. Oh. All right.